Well, thank you for watching this video. Uh, this video is brought to you by newqbo.com. That's our QBO blog. So, you better check it out. We have great articles and free video tutorials to help you. So, in this video, I'm going to uh, talk about how to set up and run sales by state report using customer type in QuickBooks Online. This is uh, focus is sales, customer sales by state report in QuickBooks Online. Uh, be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channels. Uh, it's youtube.com for watch that VB controller, youtube.com QuickBooks QBO. Okay, so I'm going to go to uh, QuickBooks Online and I'm going to show you how to run a sales by state report. So this happens to be, uh, uh, so for this one you need to use customer type. So you go to, uh, let's just say all sales. Okay, so let's go to customers. And you will see uh, customer type on on top here. Okay, so first you need to create customer type. So the customer type, if you have plus plan or uh, advanced plan, I'm using the advanced plan. So if you have plus or advanced, you'll have the customer type feature. But if you have essentials uh, and uh, a simple start, uh, you won't have this feature. So this vi this video won't be uh, helpful to you. Uh, so uh, let's just see how you set up customer type. This is pretty straightforward. So I've already set up, uh, you know, this happens, for example, this is a demo. Let's say this is uh, e-commerce and you sell uh, all over uh, 50 states and you need to track sales by states. Okay, so, uh, so let's create a new customer type. I've already created uh, all states. And so let's click this and then create customer type. In this case, I've created Alabama, Alaska, Arizona, and so on. So that's all you need to do. And once you do that, then what you need to do is you need to go to your customer base, customer profile, and all these, and you need to update and select your uh, the customer type. All right, in this case, customer detail. As you can see here, the customer type, I've already selected Alabama. And customer type field is, you go to additional info, and then you select uh, uh, your uh, customer type all right in this case uh, by state name okay so same thing with the uh, other states Alaska same thing see you got the customer type Iowa same thing you know so that's what you need to do and once you do that you basically create your uh, uh, invoices right just like regularly you know it's nothing different and then you can select uh, you can run a uh, uh, report sales report and sort it by uh, state so I'm going to show you how to run the report there's only one report actually so here's the report so sales by customer detail customer type detail so if you go down i already put that on the favorite list but if you go down you will see it so under here sales by customer type detail so this is the one report you need you know if you click it And in this case, so this is grouped by uh, customer type, you know. Uh, and if you just run the sales report, you can also get the group by customer type too. So let's go back to report in here. So let's go down. Customer sales, sales by customer detail. It's the same report, it's just grouped by, this one is grouped by customer, and the other one is grouped by uh, uh, customer type. See here the customer type. 
so it's the same report it is listed here so you all, it's all by sorted by uh, uh, state in here you know I only have uh, this one invoice for each state this is a demo thing so you'll have uh, all the sales you, you know report by uh, state and uh, if you don't like this uh, report name you can customize it you know let's just say sales by state so sales detail detail by state there we go you can change the name too oh that's our website okay so once you're happy with this you can re review it uh, see sales detail by state and uh, then you can customize it so this is already customized and just save it next time if you want to see it sales detail by state name just save it right there and just save it okay so next time you want to run this report let's go to custom reports and here it is so they have standard you go to standard and you can customize it if you want you know the way you want it and then sales by state it's right here and this is on a accrual basis so if you want to see well I want to run sales detail by state uh, on cash basis or only only when invoices are paid well then this switch to cash in this case I don't have any paid invoices in here it's a demo thing so this is this will be if you change it to cash then these are this one this report is based on invoices paid or sales receipt all right so that's the focus of this video so anyway uh, uh, they, they don't have uh, other reports you can run by your state you know normally you have sales detail and that one should be automatically sorted by uh, uh, by state if you have the uh, customer uh, address information but right now they don't have it so this is one way one, one workaround uh, to get the uh, job done anyway thank you for watching this video have a great day